You think they put me on that bus for my good behavior? That's the bus to Blackrock. Blackrock? Yeah, you know. Blackrock Federal Pen. <laughs> Where they put the worst of the bad people. People too bad for the mainland. <laughs> Hello? Is this the radio station at Perseverance Mills? Is there a doctor with you? You need to take my message. You need to deliver it for me. It's important. Ask for Atwood. Atwood. Got it. What's the message? Wintermute. Just that. Atwood will know what it means. What's in the case? I have no idea. Should I show you what happened to the last person who lied to me? She didn't look so pretty after I was done. She? Don't worry, pilot. You'll be with her soon. Back where season one ended. God, I missed Mackenzie. Why do we have to carry this sack of shit? He's heavy as hell. Shut the fuck up. Mathis says carry the asshole. We carry him. They're getting closer. The wolves? You hear about what happened to Leclerc? Don't believe everything you hear, dumbass. Arrow in the chest, man! The chest! No wolves be doing that. Really? That's Molly, isn't Wolves it? Wolves don't use bows. You figure that out all by yourself? Piss off. Something's hunting us out here, and it ain't just wolves. Mathis will figure it out. What the hell are we even doing out here? This has got to be the prisoners, right? Remember the plan. First we get daughter out. Donner, that crazy fucker. This is bullshit. Shh. He's coming back here. Order. Hey. Hey, Mathis. He's finally awake. Yep. That's the prisoners. Oh. Well, well. He lives. No thanks to you. Turns out you have a damn hard head, pilot. I told you I was stubborn. Woman. Hmm. Oh, you mean the one you asked about in the dam? Yeah. She's still there. Won't be going anywhere soon. You bastard. Relax, Mackenzie. She had nothing to do with you. He knows our oh, name? Dear. Just some um, old lady lost in the woods. Wandered into the dam when I was there. She saw me and wouldn't stop screaming, so I shut her up. You think that would be Molly? <laughs> oh, you have no idea. Why are you so worried about her? I. It doesn't matter. Could it have anything to do with this? I told you, I have no idea what that is. Well, it's okay, pilot. We'll find a way to open it very soon. And then we'll both know what's inside. For some reason, he reminds me of Negan. Hey, uh, Mackenzie? Yeah. You look like shit. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> shit got Mathis? me. 
How long we have to carry this heavy bastard for? Shut up, man. Don't pull me fat that now as well. That bastard may be our ticket off this rock, so carry him. And like the man says, shut the fuck up. They found us! <laughs> Oh. Better drop me fight back, dude. Jesus. I need a weapon. Come and get some Oh, Jesus. So the chance took it. Damn. Where's the pilot? Can't let them find me. We're gonna be on the run. My hands free. All right. Let's see. What, what do we have? What do we have? Let's continue further down here. There's gonna be some sort of rock or something. I think they're coming after me. Oh yeah. The downside of the snow, eh? Nowhere to go. What an introduction to season three, eh? Oh, wow. It's good to be back as Mackenzie. This is so cool. Yep, still off to me. Let's get out of here. Got a cave. Let's get in. At this moment in time, I wish I had the bear round. You, you better get him, or there'll be hell to pay. Yeah, you don't want to mess with Matthias, do you? Get far with those wolves hunting him. Look, you dumbass. Mathis says the pilots are taking over this damn island. Don't you want to get back to the mainland? But Eller, the arrow in the chest, man. The French accent. Let's go find this guy before Mathis loses his temper again. You know what he's like when he's angry. Let's go. Between Mathis and the wolves. I have a bad feeling about this place. Le French Canadian. The accent is growing on me, to be honest. Let's get out of here. We need to... Uh, we need to find clothing, first of all. Somewhere to get warm. Maybe get some food. Dude, what an introduction. Damn. That is actually really cool. It feels like they upped the production value with each and every episode. Wow. I'm... Uh, I'm amazed, and uh, this just reminds me of the whole, yeah, Negan situation, and it's it's gonna be interesting to have a group. I think this is gonna be the hostiles this time. It's not gonna be the bear. It's actually gonna be the prisoners and Matthias as the as the main villain, I guess. Oh, dude, this will be amazing. Uh, let me double check that. I actually, go here. Oh wow, we're in pain. The wrist, broken rib. Wow. Yeah. All from the fall, I take it. We're in really bad shape here. Ah, there you go. Rusty saw blade. Oh. Might be. Sh <sighs> That's perfect. Let's get in and see if we can make a fire to warm up. Get some pills. We need to get some cloth as well, don't we? I forgot what I was talking about before. <laughs> uh, no. There you go. Thinking of you out here. All alone. Did it bring you something special? Leaving us like you did? And for what? 
for Blackrock? We waited so long, Papa. <laughs> Sorry. Did you think of us at the end of things? I'm glad I came all this way, finally. If only to see what it was all about. Living in this defenseless place, I sat for a bit, listening for your voice. All I heard were wolves with a warm heart. Bonnie. It's just the papa. Uh, papa was the way of it. <laughs> just got me. <laughs> we need to continue. Uh, can I collect this maybe? No, I can't. Yeah, we. I think we just need to push through here. Can't stay out too long. Let's get up. Here you go, Mackenzie. Push on. Get up. Let me. Let me climb. Here you go. Oh. Looks like I finally found a use for your metal case. We have unfinished business, pilot. Stick around. Oh, we're in big trouble. Well, at least we have walls and a roof and a, hopefully heat. Warm enough. Oh, it's... Yeah, I tried to see the good and the bad, I guess. that into another cell oh it's good to be back man i oh i miss this and also as i said before mackenzie oh what a lad uh get out on it <laughs> there you are well welcome to the shit show okay so who are you unfortunately i run this place that doesn't seem to be working out too well for you. Yes, well, normally I'm on the other side of the bars. Name's Franklin. I'm warden here at Black Rock. And oh, you? I see. Mackenzie. Franklin, what's going on here? The situation is this. You and I are locked up in here. Mathis and his gang of thugs are trying to break someone out of solitary. We're still alive, for now. So they must need us for something. The power's been out for days, and nobody is coming to help. Sounds about right. Um, so yeah, obviously they are. Uh, they said earlier they needed the pilot to get away from this island. I guess if they find the plane, but would those actually work? If you think about it, if the vehicles doesn't work, would the plane work? I don't know. Well, I guess we'll see. Matthias. So, Mathis. You know. Mathis. Oh, yeah. Sorry. We go way back. He was in for murder on the mainland about 10 years ago. He did seven and then got off on parole. I was warden at one of the federal pens there, and, well, let's just say Mathis isn't sending me any Christmas cards these days. Any idea what he's doing here? Unfortunately, yeah. He's here for Donner. Brother? Donner. Who's that? His son. Oh. Shit. So, some kind of <gasps> twisted family reunion. It wasn't the guy that we killed Mathis in the start, bad, what? Right? He's old school bad. Murder, larceny, the occasional heist, and grand theft auto. But Donner? He's a chip off the old block, and then some. So, not a good person. Well, he's locked up in Blackrock, isn't he? Listen, Mathis is bad, but Donner? something much worse 
I've seen a lot of criminals in my years, and Donner, he's one of those guys that keeps wardens like me up at night. He's evil to the core. You would imagine being a warden. He's the kind of guy they make prisons like Black Rock for. I'm too big of a pussy for that. There's no redemption for guys like Donner. They aren't here for rehabilitation. There's no way back to living in regular society again. They just want to destroy the world you and I live in. If Mathis is bad, Donner is biblical bad. Hmm, that doesn't sound too good. I, I don't, yeah, as I said, would it be the guy that we actually killed with the knife in the beginning when we took the knife? Or, well, we don't know if he's dead. I would just assume, maybe. I mean, that would be pretty bad if uh, Mathis would actually find out that we had something to do with her son. Oh, his son. Oh, all right, Blackrock. So, Blackrock? Yeah, maximum security prison. Built a hundred years ago and updated a few times. It's basically a fortress. Out here? You notice the walls on your way in? I was, uh... No. Okay, well, they aren't that high or that impressive, really. You know why? No idea. The nature? Because whatever dumb son of a bitch tries to escape from this place has to get through about 50 clicks of brutal terrain full of dangerous wildlife before they can even think about finding a road that leads out of here. It's like Alcatraz, right? Well, That's what, what it's called? Here? In San Francisco? With the water? Yeah. Sharks? But are you gonna get out? About 20 years ago, a pair of cons escaped. They came back three days later, half dead, begging us to take them back. And that was in the middle of summer. Oh, shit. I get the picture. Pretty crazy that we have been surviving this long, then, I. Eh? So, Donner is a very bad guy. Mathis came here to spring him. Tell me again why we aren't dead yet. Well, that's a story. Power went out here a couple of weeks ago now. The backups held for a while, but eventually the cons were able to break out and overwhelm the guards. They grabbed the keys to solitary, went to get Donner, which, well, that would have been the end. But they couldn't open the gates to solitary. Something has them locked down tight and it's driving Mathis crazy. It was bad for us. I haven't seen any of the other guards since they locked me up in here and, well, I fear the worst. And now that Mathis is here? Locked. But with the power down, what's keeping the gates locked? There are mechanical failsafes in the system. Keep in mind, most of this jail is pretty old. But that's not the full answer to why Donner is still locked up. What do you mean? Well, best I can tell, they should have been able to break him out by now. But something, or someone, has been getting in the way. You mean, there's someone else still Ooh. out there? That's exactly what I mean. Wait, with the arrows? But who? Molly, is it? I don't know. But sounds like Mathis is as mad as a hornet because of them, and that brings me no small pleasure. Shit, they're coming. Get back to your bunk. Dude, I was thinking Molly. Molly went a little bit vigilante at the end right there, right? So, pilot, you're back in the land of the living. For now. Yeah, but just seeing you gives me a headache. <laughs> well, just seeing you makes me want to hit people. The mullet guy. It's a typical Canadian. Look at him. Flannel. So, the uh, mullet. It's fucking like we have a legend. Problem. I still can't get into solitary. You have any idea why that might be? I told you, Mathis, the whole jail is in some kind of weird lockdown. It all happened before you got here. Donner just... <laughs> Don't you ever say his name. Oh, we know he hits hard as well. I, I don't know anything about it. My guys say someone's been tampering with the system. They say it's gotten worse. Every time they take a step closer to breaking into solitary, something new gets in their way. Hmm. 
Didn't you used to run this place? Yeah. So you're telling me you have no idea how it works? That's just the thing. Nothing is working the way it's supposed to right now. Bullshit. Stop wasting my time. <laughs> and stop wasting your time. You don't have much left. Unless we get that door open. Mathis, I don't know anything. Let me jog your memory. Oh. Yeah. We're gonna say something? Hey! Hey, Mathis! Maybe not so hard. Yeah, dude. Like, Fuck. We might still need him to get him out. Mathis. Uh, he doesn't look good. You're going too far. <laughs> yeah, he's fucking. He, he lost it, dude. Clean him up. Um, just imagine his son then. Asshole. Oh, shit. He looks bad. Yeah. Mathis. He's getting worse. Even those guys Shit, think he's losing half, it. Half crazy. Half crazy? Ever since the bus crash, he's been getting wild, like a caged animal. How the hell did he expect this to turn out? You remember Montreal, right? Oh, yeah. I mean, remember that place on St. Catherine's with the girl <sighs> who... Not that, you fucking moron. Remember how Mathis broke out? Oh, yeah. I wasn't there, but I heard about it. Right. You clean up the warden, and I'll tell you all about it. So there was this really tight plan. Mathis had months to set it up. Everyone had their part to play. It was like, out of a fucking movie. So we bust out, and all hell breaks loose. We get to the front gates. <laughs> it's a mess, right? Place is in chaos. And the driver who's supposed to pick us up, he's late. No shit. No shit. So the driver pulls up, like, two minutes late. Alarms going off everywhere. It's like, the prison guards are coming after us. We're gonna get grabbed at any second. We're yelling at Mathis, come on, man, let's go, let's get out of here. And Mathis just stands there, looking at the fucking driver. Looking like... He wants to eat the guy. Hmm. The driver's terrified. Mathis walks over to the van. Slowly. We're all jumping in and yelling to get out. And we... And we can see the fucking guards coming. Like, we are done. We need to get out. Mathis. He pulls the driver out of the van. Looks back at us and... With this totally wild look in his eyes. Just says, go. Like totally calmly, but with this wild edge. And he just starts beating the living shit out of the driver. Jesus. Wow. I knew it went bad in Montreal, but I didn't know that story. Yeah, I mean, we took off. And Mathis, it took five cops to pull him off that driver. He cared less about being caught than he did about the driver. Being late. Maybe it's just as bad Crazy as the bear fuck. then, eh? Mathis is not a patient man. Maybe worse. He does not like it when a plan does not come together. He does not like to be let down. And right now, his plan for getting Donner out of here is totally fucked. It's just a matter of time before he... snaps. Like he did in Montreal. I guess we don't want to be around here then. It's bad, eh? What are we going to do? If he dies, it'll be worse for us, because we'll take the heat. We need to get him patched up. Well, we passed some kind of first aid building on the way in. Great. Go there and grab some supplies. No fucking way. You hear all those words? No out fucking there? way, Don't be bud. An asshole. Go do it. <laughs> I love it. You do it. I'm his Why do I have to be the one who Hey! Who went back to look for Leclerc when he went missing? No way I'm going back out there. I'll do it. Yes, Mackenzie! Did fucking hero. Something? 
I said I'll do it. Let me out, and I'll get the supplies. Nobody's talking to you, pilot. Just keep quiet and hope that Mathis doesn't start paying attention to you. He dies and you guys take the rap. You want that? The rap? Take the rap? Who talks like that? Listen, pilot. Why don't you shut the fuck up? What do you have to lose? I go out there, get attacked by wolves? No great loss, right? Wait a second, man. I'm loving this. this. Is a bad idea. Mathias has plans for this guy. Shut up. All right. You're right. You've been out in the bush all this time. I'm sure you figured out how to deal with a few wolves by now. We let you out. You get the supplies. The warden lives and maybe. We keep Mathis distracted so he doesn't lose his shit on you next time. Understood. You let me out, I get the supplies. The warden lives. Ha! <laughs> you see? He learns fast. Time to save the day, pilot. Don't fuck it up. Alright, we're outside again. Get going, pilot. <laughs> the warden doesn't have much time left. Oh, yeah. And in case you're thinking of running away, remember... We still have your precious case. We still need that case. I mean, we don't know what's in it. Not <sighs> even being Astrid. Brutal, deadly cold. How I've missed you. How I missed you, Mackenzie. Let's see. And they didn't give us any more clothing. All right. We got to have to check all of this then. Check the cars if we can find anything. It feels like all of this should, yeah, should already be looted. Can't open the trunks. Matches, yeah, we're gonna need everything that we can get our filthy little paws on right now. Let's check the bus. A little bit of nuts. Some cloth, yeah, we're gonna need that, don't we? Some paper. Can already hear the wolves. Think I can use this. Yeah. Howling from the outside. Do we have anything in the in the back? Oh no. Let's pick up. Check this one. Alright, it seems like we're gonna get ourselves. Okay, he put that on. Uh some some food at least. Some nuts. Let's head towards the gate. If we can get out of here. I don't know if that... It looks open, right? We might not be able to get out this way. That's all chained up. That's all locked. This one as well. What have we here? Main entrance. Alright. This way then. Dude, this is such a cool setting. I love this. Oh, infirmary. Here you go. That might actually have what we need, no? I mean, that is where we're going. I'm pretty sure. Here you go. With the memory of a goldfish, you know? Uh, locked. Locked. We need to find a pry bar or something. Mm. And also, we don't really have anything to fight. Yeah, fight back towards those guys, do we? Look at that. Snacking away. Ooh, a backpack. Could end up being useful. Uh, socks. Already put those on. It's perfect. Uh, we could actually make a fire right here. If needed, keep that in mind. I think we had a pry bar right there. That's perfect. That should be what we need, hopefully. It's something nice uh, starting over like this. Oh, well. Ooh, gunpowder. That's new. Just finding uh, 
Oh, well, it's starting from scratch. Just starting to find everything again. Just being empty. Uh, sport vest. Can we put that on? It's already on. And we are wet. We need to dry up. Uh, there you go. My husband got recruited by some old Navy buddy of his. This was in the early 50s, and we uh, weren't exactly in a good spot then. As I found out later from some of the other wives, no good road leads to Black Rock. We had a little cabin in a hamlet, a way away from the prison. A lot of the staff lived nearby, but not all. Some puts as much distance between them and the prison as possible. Even when winters made that uh, thought go when you had shift. I tried not to think about what went on up there. It changed my husband somehow. He was a sweet man. If a little lost and unlucky in his work. Like a lot of men were back then. But our time on the Great Bear at that place, well... It left him sad in a way I can't explain. I tend to a garden and wrote endless letters to my sisters. That's how I remember those years. Endless writing. Waiting to leave as the seasons passed. Stay there for some reason. That hurts me heart. New objects. Uh, search for bloodstained pages inside the outside. Ooh, okay. Okay, okay. We can do that. Tinder plug. Some fuel. Let's leave the paper. We have enough with that so far. Oh, all right. I had no clue this door was actually open. I don't really know how to handle that guy then. Uh, we're gonna go back and see if we can, uh, yeah, open the door to the infirmary. I don't think we will be, but I need to find some way in. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, no, no. All right, let's uh, throw some rocks and hope for the best. Get low. There you go. Third rocks the charms. I'm pretty sure I hit him in the balls with the first one. <laughs> yeah, you better run away. You know what? I'm going to pick up some more rocks here. Here you go. Yoink. Yoink. I started to think about that as well. In prisons, like when you're a prisoner working with stuff, don't you have that in the States? Like, I know I've heard... Scared me? I, I know I heard that uh, some uh, prisons have, like, you, uh, there's prisoners making the license plates for cars. In some states. You know what? I'm not going out there. That, that's a lot of uh, wolves around. Jesus, where are you? They've heard about me. They've heard about Mackenzie. I am the big bad wolf. <laughs> Let's see down here. What do we have? Uh, boxes we can break down. We can open that door. We're going to wait a little bit. I want to go this way as well because this said infirmary, right? Yeah. And that's where we're going. We're just going to check back here so I don't miss anything. What's this then? Is this some sort of... Uh, this might be a completely different block, eh? Actually, wouldn't know. Uh, no, 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 okay. This is the entrance, isn't it? To, um, I mean, I, it might not be the entrance. All right, let's go back. We can't get in there, but I'm assuming this might be one of the entrances into the prison. Uh, so let's get back. Let's go to the infirmary and see what we can get. Rawr! Rawr! I, I hate myself. If he's like the prisoner's... <sighs> All right, let's try that again. It feels like the prisoners would have been out here trying to loot as much as they can, right? Here we go. Weapon-wise and such. Sewing kit. Food. Thank you very much. Candy bar. Oh, uh, I still eat, eat this. You know what? Just gonna close that door. Feels way more safe that way. For being here a while, it seems like these guys, like something as as a big of a necessity food would be. Antiseptic, yeah, dude, yeah. The prisoners are not that smart, are they? 
I could use this. Thermal underwear, that's perfect, ain't it? Oh, yeah. The thing is, the shirt and the stuff is pretty... They are torn. I could fix them by now, but I think we might be able to find something better. That's why I'm not doing it. I think I can use this. So we're going to take a look later on, depending on if we have more stuff. Depending on what we find here. That's it, you know? Instead of wasting my sewing kit on stuff, we might be able to... Uh... Ooh, there you go. You know what I mean? If we are able to find... Ooh, Blackrock Locker Key. We can pry those open. What am I trying to say? If we can find other clothing, that's what I'm trying to say. Jesus. Just me interrupting myself. Uh, can we get out this way? Yeah, we can. But I think this leads out to the car. Let's get up here. Get out. Dude, the uh, wolf is such an awesome animal, but it's very... A very scary animal as well. Such a smart one. Seems like we're going to be taking the cat walks. They are everywhere. The cat walks up to the infirmary. This is such a cool place, isn't it? Wow. Mittens. Put those on, Mackenzie. Time through. Yes, more clothing. Look at us go, dude. That is so good. That is really, really nice. Uh, take it. I'll leave the book. Noise. Um, can't get into that. We can get out there. What is it that we actually need? Just search the nurse's office. Okay. Just gonna look through these as well. And as I've said many times before, I'm not picking everything up right now because we are going to be on the move at all times. Receiver, okay. And uh, just having your inventory up just with the things that you need could be good. I don't, yeah, I don't want to that have too much on me saying that. But <laughs> putting on some <laughs> a, a new pair of shoes, but I'm thinking I could tear those down, right? Let's see if I can do that right now. Harvest to get some leather. Exactly. Yeah, I just saw that as well. The knight is on its way. Ooh, hello. Hello? Hello? Who the hell are you? Molly! Right? Well, no? I ask you the same question. Quit fucking around. No, it is right. Who are you? I'm nobody important. Just a bush pilot. My name is... Uh, Say it. You forgot your name. My name's Mackenzie. Right. Well, Mr. Mackenzie. No, that's not Mr. Mackenzie. Just Mackenzie. Well, Mr. Bush Pilot Mackenzie. No, that's Welcome not Molly. Party. You working for those assholes in prison? Which ones? I mean, no. No, I'm not working for them. Then what are you doing out here? Where are you calling me from? Somewhere safe. Look, Mr. McKenzie, soon you're gonna have to figure out whose side you're on in this little stalemate we have going on. I don't know anything about a stalemate. And I'm not on anyone's side. Hmm. I'm on my own. A little side. bit of a war between well, sides. You're honest. That's a start. Yeah, this girl got a little bit of a lisp. Molly didn't have that. What do you want? That question has a long damn answer. Right now, I'm safe from those prison assholes. But I cannot say the same for you. Look, the prison warden, he's injured. I'm just trying to keep him alive. So they let you out of the prison. Then they're just going to let you back in? Right. They need me. But you aren't helping them. No. Something about this situation, about you, doesn't fit. 
Look, why don't you tell me where you are and maybe I can help you? <laughs> help me? Shit, man. You can't even help yourself. Are you the one that's messing up the convict's plans? Maybe I am. Maybe I'm not. Either way, I'm not telling you. Mm. How do I know you aren't really one of Donner's boys? Trying to trap me. Donner. So you know about him. Wake up, man. This is all about Donner. Don't you get that? And I'm the only thing standing between that fucker rotting away in solitary and an evil bastard being unleashed of the rest of this frozen hellhole. Well, I mean, I hear it's nice in the summer. Take care of yourself, Mr. Mackenzie. Those wolves sound pretty hungry to me. I'll do my best. Seem to be so many new characters oh. introduced. That was weird. This is amazing. I do, we need to hurry up a little bit. Okay, let's uh, get what I can. The key, the memo. Dr. Chills, we got a call from the main gate about some kind of accident down the hill. I turned over our emergency kit to one of the officers who was going to take a truck down and check it out. What with all of the wolves' activity lately? The thing is, that kit has just about the loss of our morphine and uh, our good antibiotics. Please make sure to check inventory and put a restock order in as soon as you can. Thanks, but the car waits. So, exiting downhill, turned over emergency kit to one of the officers who was going to take it. Was going to take a truck down and check it out. Um, take it. A memo. We got the key. Yeah, exactly. That's what I thought. So we need to. Where are we? Oh, yikes. Yeah, we need to get down all the way to find a truck. Dang it. I need to find a bedroll of some sort. At least we need to sleep through the... Ah, oh, there you go. Thank you. Sleep through the night. Uh, able to open that. I think what we're gonna do is put on a fire. Maybe. You know what? We might be... I think we can unlock that. But I think we might be able to just sleep through the night inside here. Inside the firmary. Infirmary. Let's do that. Slap it out on the ground. It's not going to be the most comfortable sleep, but I think we will do. We close the window. Let's get a few hours. Don't have a lantern or anything like that. Oh, we had a fire back there, though. Uh, but yeah. Let's see if we can get down. Dude, how cool is this? Uh, maybe this door. There we go. Close it. Oh, we could have slept here then. Oh, hello. Distress pistol. We're gonna need that. Noisemaker. That's something new. Well, well. What Revolver ammunition. Maple syrup! Yeehaw! <laughs> I was about to say. <laughs> yeah. Dude, I love maple syrup. Let's do this. We need to make it down. We need to make it down. Just follow the road through, I guess, the passage right here. Get into Black Rock Blues right there to find the car. Yeah, we're gonna. This is all gonna be up in the mountains. This might be a little bit yikes. We'll see. We'll manage, though. We'll manage. Got some deer. Got some elk moving about. It's almost like I can feel the cold. Let's check this out. This Hunting rifle. Yes! Two bullets. Just want Mackenzie to say, Oh, yeah. Oh, I survived another nut. <laughs> that gets me going. Oh, wow. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's a big old crevice. Ooh, 
Look at that. Rope bridge? I think. Maybe just a wooden bridge. I don't know. Mm, 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 mm. Crossing the bridge. Yeah, it should be here. In there. We're going to check these cars out, though. It should be a patrol car. Uh, climbing area. <gasps> Are we going to do some climbing? I don't know why. <laughs> I forgot how to enter cars. <laughs> I forgot how to open doors. <laughs> why am I not surprised? Ooh. Looks like someone's been here recently. Yup. Love that. No, it doesn't seem like anyone is going to use it. Let's follow the blood trail here. Let's reload the weapon. You think that's it? No, no, no. Do you think? See, we don't... We haven't seen any more blood trails, have we? Oh. Yeah, he's scared. Here we go. Looks like I made it through another night. Yes! He shut it! Can't climb that. First of all, follow the blood. Check this out. Yeah, he's not doing too well, is he? Maybe uh, just warm up inside the cave here. Unless there is a bear in there. Wonder if this is any good to eat. Yep. Here you go. Medication. Yoink it. That should be what we needed. Return to Black Rock. It's perfect. Uh, campfire. Place it down. Start it. I'm gonna add some fuel as well. gonna add everything to just make ourselves a little bit lighter uh clothing you know what while we're getting warmer we could try to fix maybe the pants at least these ones repair these and we're all warm we're all good to go We're a little bit better than we were before. I'm gonna grab this as well. I don't know. I don't think we're gonna be using that, to be honest, but we have it. Let's see where this is gonna lead. I kinda wanna go here, though. You think this is gonna be short? <laughs> this is not gonna be shortcut. <laughs> is it? But I, I really do wanna climb it. It's always making me so nervous. Ever since I... Oh, well, always. Since the last time I cl climbed with Astrid, she just slowed down so hard and it just made me clench and cry. It's a beautiful crown on that. Um, Where are we going then? You know what? I feel like this is stupid. I can see it. We made it back. That, uh, that actually... You know what? Let's... Uh, what am I doing? Let's holster this. There you go. Just fat fingering everywhere. I don't know how um, popular, popular this is going to be with me coming back with guns. I feel like if this would be reality, these guys would uh, slap me down and take it all. But uh, I don't know. Ah, uh, maybe uh, just a little bit of, you know, a nice slap. Because they don't want to hurt me. Because then they have to go out to get stuff to save me. So, but, you know, you know. <laughs> I don't know what I'm talking about. Uh, let's get back in. Music hits as I see that beautiful flag waving in the wind. This is actually a pretty nice little place. Hide your items. Oh, dude, 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 dude. Comf okay, 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 okay. Dude, how cool is that? Uh, I'm just gonna put this in there. I think like the food and everything. I, that, I was about to say that. That's really, really cool. Anything that can go boo? Maybe the pry bar? I don't know. 
Uh, ammunition. Because I feel what the other things, they wouldn't care, right? And is that all? Yeah, I think all the bullets in, is inside the rifle. Dude, I'm so happy they actually told me. And that that was actually, well, as I said, right there, that's a, oh, that's a big sun. It's actually a big concern, that. Because it feels like that would be a thing. And it actually was. That's so cool. I always mean my can't yeah. say. Shit. You made it. I made it. I guess you're tougher than you look. I found stuff to help the warden. Medical supplies. Yeah. You'd better get in there to see him. He doesn't look too good. But first, you gotta let me frisk you. Mattis had have my balls if I let you sneak a knife in here. Do I have a knife? I don't think we have a knife, do I? In the town on the hill Where the apples grow And the church bells ring Every hour or so I took a little walk just to see the ships coming in The sun 